What's up YouTube? Jeff, your style OG. And on today's video, we're gonna talk about how to wear those brogues. If you're new to the channel, we release a new video every day at 4 p.m. Eastern, discussing various men's lifestyle topics, such as style, grooming, and dating. I invite you to subscribe, tap that notification bell, and join us. And to my returning friends, like Syed Fazan, salute. Now, hands down, the brogue is one of the most versatile items you can have in your closet. And I'm not just talking about shoes. I'm talking about period. This bad boy, you can dress it up, you can dress it down. You can wear it with jeans, chinos, trousers, even a suit. And in an effort to show you just how versatile the brogue is, I'm going to show you how to wear it four different ways. Gonna show you how to dress it up, dress it down, and a couple of ways in between. So without any further delay, let's get into this lookbook on how to rock those bros. Now first off, for those who may not be in the know, let's talk a little bit about what a brogue dress shoe is. It's simply a dress shoe that has these ornamental perforations going around the shoe. Now the more perforations you have on a shoe, the more casual it is. The less perforations, the more elegant, more dressy. So in that vein, you have full brogues, which have broguing going all the way around the shoe, half brogues, quarter brogues, and semi brogues. So broguing actually refers to the details on the shoe. So that means they can be an Oxford, they can be a Derby. The example I'm gonna use in all four looks today is this full brogue. As you can see, full broguing all the way around the shoe. So now that we actually know what a brogue shoe is, Let's get into this lookbook. Now for our first look, I wanted to show you a brogue in a great fall or spring look with a little bit of layering as we have these nice dark brown brogues with the pair of chinos. Now chinos and brogues definitely go well together. They both straddle that line between dressy and casual excellently. And as you can see here with my brogues, I got one of my favorite pair of chinos, these nice olive chinos from Peter Manning NYC. Then adding a little bit layering to it on top. Got this nice tailored sweatshirt I picked up from Banana Republic a couple of months ago. And for the top layer, one of my favorite denim trucker jackets. This nice raw denim one I grabbed from the Gap maybe six or seven years ago, still looks great. So as you can see, the Brogue does a great job of walking the line between casual and dressy. This is a fantastic look, I think, for a great weekend or fall or spring date night. Cool casual, comfortable, but still stylish with these brogues. Now for our second look of the day, I've got another combination that straddles the line between dressy and casual. Two great items that do that. Of course, I'm talking about the brogues and your most versatile dress up or dress down pair of denim, your dark denim. Now, as you can see here, got a nice, cool, casual look with a little bit of style added to it with the brogues. As I have the dark brown brogues once again, Paired with my favorite pair of dark denim, these from a Uniqlo, I probably had these about two or three years from now, my go-to pair of denim. And up top, to keep it in nice and simple, got a great Oxford cloth button down, a gray striped one, had this from J. Crew, probably about a year or two now, very comfortable, very soft. Now these three items together are some of your most versatile items you can have. Oxford button down, super versatile, dark denim, super versatile, brogues, especially in brown, super versatile. This is a classic, easy, relaxed, but casual look that you can wear now and anytime. Now, if you're gonna be rocking this Oso oh versatile shoe, it helps to buy a brogue that's of great quality, well-made, and it doesn't hurt if you don't pay a whole lot of money. Like we have from today's video sponsor, Beckett Seminar, who not only sponsored today's video, but provided this beautiful brown brogue you see me rocking, throughout the lookbook. Now, Becky Seminon is one of my frequent video collaborators, and I'll tell you why. They make a great, high-quality shoe at an excellent price. And how did they do that? By being direct to consumer. They don't have a whole bunch of retail stores. They don't have a lot of wasted inventory. Once you order a shoe from them, they make it. We're talking about super high-quality shoes, handmade one at a time, using great Argentinian leather, and Beckett Seminon has every type of shoe to fit your footwear needs. I'm talking about Oxfords. I'm talking about sneakers. I'm talking about boots, hole cut. Looking for a high quality, well-made shoe? Beckett Seminon has it. And that definitely includes today's shoe, this Yates Oxford Bro. Now with this, we've got great quality and construction. 
full grain Argentinian calf leather upper, horrible leather soles with Blake construction, which means they're very elegant, very aesthetic, and they can be resold with a full grain leather lining for extra durability and it helps reduce the odor as well. And as you can see, it's just an absolutely gorgeous shoe. Full brogue, beautiful brown bronishing at the toe. What more can you ask for? Now, not only did Becca Seminar sponsor today's video, they also hooked the Stylogy family up with a 20% discount. All you have to do is enter code OG at checkout for 20% off a pair to a beautiful handmade but affordable shoe. And for our third look of the day, I want to give you a cool, classic, elegant, grown man look. And we have that in the look I have on right now as I rock these brogues with a wool turtleneck. Now I'm always trying to get you guys to rock the turtleneck. It's just a classic, elegant look. It's super timeless, especially when you grab a great color like a navy one. This navy merino wool one I've had for the last couple of years from Uniqlo. And of course, I'm completing the look with one of my favorite pair of trousers, a pair of gray wool herringbone trousers. Blue and brown, one of my favorite combinations. Gray and brown, another favorite combination. Of course, you can never go wrong with navy and gray. We have all represented in this look. This is a look I think you can look great on a cool night, maybe at a bar, on a date. It's just sexy and easy going at the same time. Once again, showing the versatility of that brown bro. You want something cool, classic, timeless, but elegant? Definitely rock a nice turtleneck, pair of wool trousers, and those bros. And for our fourth and final look of the day, we're staying with our navy and gray combination and showing you probably the dressiest look you want to rock with a pair of bros, as we have a nice suit with your bros. Now, as far as the dressing the scale you want to go with a pair of bros, you don't want to go formal. I probably would go semi-formal and below because a brogue isn't a fully dressy shoe. It's slightly casual as opposed to other dress shoes, so keep that in mind. As you can see here, this is a great way to rock a pair of dress shoes, but not be too stuffy with your suit. Kind of a dress down way to rock your suit. As I've done here with one of my favorite suits, this one from J. Crew, my J. Crew Ludlow window pane flannel suit. And this great deep navy dress shirt I'm rocking underneath, grabbed this from a made to measure company a couple of months ago called the Pasta. Nice, sleek, and elegant. Drop the tie for a dress down version of the suit. Can't go wrong with gray and blue, and you definitely can't go wrong matching one of your favorite suits with a pair of robes. Okay, so there you have it. My lookbook on how to rock that also oh versatile shoe, the bro. Once again, I want to thank today's video sponsor, Beck and Seminar. Make sure you hit that link in the description. Use code OG for 20% off a pair or two of high quality, well made, but fair priced shoes. As always, I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, hit that like button, it helps the channel to grow. And of course, tap that notification bell so you don't miss any of the videos we release every day at 4 p.m. Eastern, and I'll check you out tomorrow.